Hi, my name is Lauren Katz and I'm a semi-finalist in the Pillsbury Bake Off contest this year. My recipe is called chocolate and coconut pecan custard pie and it's super easy and quick to throw together and I'm going to show you how. It only has six ingredients. Um, the first thing that you need to do is to get the Pillsbury pre-made, pre ready-made pie crust and all you have to do is line your pie plate with that, just like you would normally do. Set that aside. And then in a mixing bowl, you're going to combine most of your other ingredients. It only takes one bowl and you don't have to dirty the whole kitchen. So the first thing that you're gonna do is throw in a can of the Pillsbury Coconut Pecan Creamy Supreme icing. And that looks like this. Then you're going to throw in a can of the Eagle Brand Sweetened Condensed Milk, the whole can, right on top of the icing. Make sure you get the whole thing in there. All right. Then you're going to put three eggs in. Always good to crack those into a separate bowl. Pour that right on top. And then, you can stir this with a spoon or a spatula. I find it's a little bit easier with a whisk. Just takes a minute to stir it up until everything is smooth and combined. Okay. Then you're just going to throw in your chocolate chips, give it another little quick whisk. Oh, the salt, that's right. So my husband's telling me off camera, put in the salt, half a teaspoon of salt. Salt is great in sweet foods. I know that sounds kind of crazy, but it actually makes um, everything taste better. It makes it taste more like what it is. So I put it in all my desserts. So then you're just going to pour this mixture straight into your pie crust. It should fill it up perfectly. Oh, I'm dripping all over my camera. You want all those chocolate chips and everything in there. Okay. I'm making a little bit of a mess. You, you could do it much neater off camera, I'm sure. Then you're just going to take your sweetened shredded coconut and sprinkle the top with that kind of all over the place. Oops. You can do it with your fingers. All right. <laughs> little Julia Child moment there. Okay, and then you're just going to throw this in the oven um, at 350 degrees for 50 to 60 minutes. If the crust starts to look a little bit brown, you can just cover it up with foil. And then you will pull it out, and it will actually souffle up a bit, and then when it cools, it will look just like this one. And you can serve it warm or at room temperature. Um, and I hope your guests enjoy it, and it would be great for Father's Day or any other occasion, Thanksgiving or Christmas as well. Thank you, and please go to Pillsbury.com and vote for my recipe. I'm one of 60 semifinalists, and I really need your online vote to get to the finals in Las Vegas. Um, there we would be competing for the $1 million prize. Thanks so much. Bye-bye. To vote for Lauren's recipe, please visit www.pillsbury.com or www.bakeoff.com. Click the Bake Off Contest link, and then click Voting. Scroll down the page until you see the Vote Now button and click it. If you've never visited Pillsbury.com before, you'll be asked to register and create an account. Please provide your email address, create a password, enter your birthday and zip code, and click Submit. After you've completed your registration, please scroll down the page until you find Lauren's recipe, Chocolate and Coconut Pecan Custard Pie. Click Vote for this recipe, and then you're done. Thank you very much.